back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to do an unboxing of this Pipeliners Cloud umbrella. I've known about Pipeliners Cloud umbrella for a long time. A lot of buddies of mine have them. They're literally a half two, in my opinion, uh, just because they're so much tougher than the um, Lapco. They hold up to the wind. They're just more stout and they cover more ground. And if you know anything about me, you know I, I get motivated by shade. So it comes in a long box, pipelinerscloud.com. 100% uh, welder owned and operated. Thanks for being our valued client. Also, for those of you that have been curious where I get my white welding caps, I also get them from Pipeliners Cloud. I love what Manuel is doing. I've never met, met Manuel in person. I've just watched the video there on his website. Carry inspired welding caps, the softest in the game. Those are the kind that I wear are the original carries. They have a couple more over there that I really like. Uh, a buddy of mine bought some and uh, he's just doing good stuff. Manuel and his team is doing good stuff. They're at Pipeliners Cloud. Quality, quality product we have here. Like I said, I've heard a lot of good about them and I'm so excited about this big umbrella. This is an eight foot in diameter umbrella. A buddy of mine that has them, it looks like an extension there. A buddy of mine that has one uh, said it's work to put it up, but he said it's totally worth it. So. Looky here, looky here, all right, all right. Okay. Wow. Look at how cool that is. Ladies and gents, I'm digging it. I'm absolutely digging it. Whoa. I'm afraid to put it in my vise. A lot of times I put it in my vise. But I've got my slam pole here too that I'll try it in here in a minute. Oh yeah, I gotta see what y'all can see. Oh yeah, look at that. Eight foot eight foot in diameter and to give you a little perspective i should really measure i want to say these are six foot in diameter let's measure this one i believe it's six foot bear with me bear with me i am ill prepared uh, a little over possibly three and a half three and a half is what seven so seven foot in diameter just under like inch or two under eight foot in diameter like an inch under 95 inches when spread out okay now let's put this slam pole in the ground They have these over there, Pipeliners Cloud also. I built that one, but they do have them. Ooh, it's got little rivets on it. I don't want to force it, may not get it out of there, but I mean, it is clearly wider, but the main deal about this umbrella is it's 
a lot tougher. Hold up to the wind. It'll go all the way inside out. Yeah, this one's two inches shy of seven foot. So one foot wider in diameter. Like I said, they make a 10 foot also. I've heard it's really heavy, but that wasn't near as bad to get up as I thought it was. But I mean a quality product. They've got a video, some of you have probably seen, of the wind. They drive it down the road and the wind flop this, flops it backwards, but then it easily pops back. Uh, so the wind is not supposed to. They were driving down the road, so you normally wouldn't get that kind of wind if they were just doing like a test. But uh, anyway, so it's to hold up to the wind, but even if it does flip back, let's get a close up of this so y'all can see what I'm staring at here. got it's just got a totally different design I'll just let you all study that instead of trying to act like I know how it's built I ain't got no idea I just know it's got these extra thingy my whoppers here it's got the shorter my whoppers there and then the original my whoppers as to where you can see this guy just got two different my whoppers and not as many it looks like one two three four five seven eight one two three four let's see one two three four five six seven, eight we're already at eight at a quarter so i'm guessing eight times four is what 32 i'm just guessing 32 rails or 32 little things instead of eight so this is why I've been so excited. They are pricey, but you know, the age old saying, you get what you pay for. That's what's kept my tight wad from buying one this whole time. But I uh, have been sold on them for a really long time. Looks like he's got a little pin here too. To... Oh yeah, safety measure. Keep her locked in place. Anyhow, I am super pumped about this thing, if you can't tell. so. That's a little short review and uh, uh, unboxing, if you will. It comes with the tube, obviously, which is cool. It is seven and a half. Well, with the lid, seven and a half. In case you need to build something to fit your pipeliner's cloud, seven and a half by call it 57 inches oh one more thing one more thing i wanted to try is this look at this it's threaded uh, those umbrellas come with an extension tube but they're not threaded this looks i don't know if it's aluminum or metal but uh, either way it's threaded that's what these rivets are therefore making it that much more quality which is super cool oh yeah you better believe it oh yes that is what I'm talking about now wow that is where it's at. Not only is this good for the old welding truck, it would actually make a good gift for your mother-in-law, your mother, your grandparents, for their picnic area, because this is super stout, better than any old picnic umbrella that you can get from the Lowe's. Hello, 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 kind of echoes under here. Anyway, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. Just wanted to show you all this awesome umbrella. Thanks for watching. For more helpful resources, check out our website, arosswelding.com. We've got several tools lists over there. We've also got a trade school where you can find the pipe fence course and the quick rig course if you're looking to build a welding rig in a short amount of time on a budget. Check out our trade school website, arosswelding.school. Thank you for being here and watching, and thank you, Pipeliners Cloud, for making quality products. We'll see you next time.